Okay everyone, so in this tutorial we're just going to quickly go through how to set up the unit settings inside 3D Studio Max so it works perfectly with Unreal. So the new Unreal Engine is changed, it no longer uses Unreal units, it actually uses like real world measurements which makes it a lot easier for us to work with. So the way that we uh, change this, I'm just in 3D Studio Max. First thing we need to do is just go to Customize and then Unit Setup. So I've left mine as what the default 3D Studio Max loaded in as. The first thing you want to do is just change it to the metric system it's by clicking up here. And then out of this list, you want to make sure it's set to centimeters. Um, now, this gets a little bit confusing because this is actually only the display unit setup. So once that's set, we need to go into the system unit setup as well. Okay, so we just click there. And here we get an option one unit equals to one. And then we get another drop down menu. We just want to make sure that's set to centimeters as well. So that means that in terms of display, it's going to be set to the correct measurement. And then also the actual unit as well is going to be set to exactly the same. Uh, we just okay that. And then we okay the next one. So just to test it out, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to make a cube. Just a box here. And I'm going to set it to be 200 centimeters by 200 centimeters. From here, I'm just going to stop the video for a quick second. I'm just going to export this out and then I'm going to import it into Unreal just to show you that it works. So, just to recap, all you do is go customize, unit setup, make sure you click on metric, set it to centimeters, go into your system unit setup, make sure one unit is equal to one centimeter. And when I load the video back up, we'll be in Unreal. Okay, so this is, um, this is just a, a blank Unreal project. All I'm going to do is going to grab a uh, BSP box here, click and drag it in. And you can see over here, this is set to have the same dimensions that we made for our cube in 3D Studio Max. So it's 200 by 200 by 200. Here's the uh, box, which I just quickly exported out. Didn't worry too much about bringing in uh, the correct smoothing groups or anything. But you can see here when I hover over, the approximate size is 200 by 200 by 200. Exactly what we made in 3D Studio Max. So I click and drop that in. You can see the two of them are exactly the same size. Okay. Um, so to stay quick, once you once you set up your project, um, I just recommend you set up your units, and then from then on in, everything you make in 3D Studio Max is going to be the exact size uh, that you want it to be in the Unreal Engine, and it's kind of going to it's going to save you a lot of time in terms of scaling and stuff.